Good evening. Hello, Glissette. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. And you? I'm excellent. Thank you. How was your weekend, Lisette? Good evening. Hello, Francisco. Good evening. Welcome to the class. Thank you. More or less, teacher. Yes. Uh, I stay home. Uh, uh, todo tranquilo aquí en casa. Ah, okay. Aburrido. Nice. Okay. Everything is okay. And uh, say, I was bored. I was bored. That's the, sí. that's the sentence. Estuve aburrido. And in your case, Francisco, how was your weekend? Um, I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? Estoy, estoy at home. Uh, watch the movie. Ah, okay. I stay at home and I watch movies. Excellent. Hello, Angelica. Welcome to the class. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you tonight? Mm, I'm fine. I study a little of English. Oh, excellent. During the weekend, you studied. Okay, English. Perfect. Thank you, Angelica. Hello, Roxana. Welcome to the class. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Tatiana, good evening. Welcome to the class. Good evening, teacher. Okay, let's start with tonight's class. Thank you, everyone, for your punctuality. So tell me, um, did you finish the platform? ¿Quién pudo terminar la plataforma en el fin de semana? Probablemente ahora la termine, o por lo menos la mitad. Ah, ok, excelente. Hello, Manuel, welcome to the class. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. 
Okay, excellent then. So we still have time. We still have uh, three days to complete the platform. So, but as, as soon as you finish, much better, right? Entre más pronto termine, mucho mejor. So. Hello, teacher. Hello, everyone. Hello, Roberto. Welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. So don't forget about that, please. You still have three days to complete the platform exercises and also the final test. So three days, don't forget that. Teacher. Yes? I have a question. Tell me, what is your question? The plat uh, hasta donde terminar hasta, hasta la sección tres, eh, seis. And there are five sections, cinco sections. Five, five. Y el examen final. Ok. If you are done. Voy por la cinco, pero no la he terminado. Ok. O oh, no. Bueno, no, no, no. Estoy por pasar a la cinco, pero ya voy a algo avanzado. Ah, ok. Excelente. So, give me a second. I'm going to show you something. Okay, I'm sharing with you my screen. So, can you see it? Let me know, please, if you can see it. Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Yes, okay, don't forget to check your progress, please. So, you have courage, discussion, progress, and instructor section. So... Don't forget to go here and progress. Well, progreso, in this case, it is in Spanish. I don't know why. And check this, please. Check it, this graph. And you are going to watch your progress here. So you have to have your platform in this way. O sea, tiene que tener su plataforma. De esta manera, ¿verdad? Completados todos los, todos los ejercicios de cada una de las secciones, que son estos. And here we're going to find the meter exam. Esta es la nota que se sacó en el meter. And this is the final exam. This is the final exam. Y acá está el porcentaje de cada uno de ellos. The homeworks. The homework. Uh, los ejercicios de cada una de las secciones vale el 30%. Let's see, the meter exam is el 30% too, and the final test is the 40%. And we have, we are going to get the 100%. So don't forget about this. So the final exam is el que vale más, the final test vale el 40%. So don't forget to take it, please. Y revisen su gráfico. Que vea que el progreso que usted ha logrado esté correcto. Do you have any question? I have a question. Tell me, Francisco, what is your question? In Spanish. Eh, vaya, literalmente terminamos eh, este jueves las clases, ¿verdad? Yes, we are going to finish on Thursday. Eh, ¿Cuándo iniciamos nuevamente? Oh, I don't have that information, but they are going to inform you when you are going to start the next course. Es que, vaya, a mí me tiraron un correo, pero me dice que iniciamos el 25 de, de, de octubre. Relativamente diría yo que es el lunes. Ah, ok. Bueno, entonces si ya tienen fecha de inicio, solo tienen que hacer el trámite de inscripción. Solo tienen que hacer el trámite de inscripción para que puedan ya aparecer en el grupo del día lunes, del día 25. Ok, thanks teacher. Ok, any other question about this? So, five section in the final test. In the final exam has six questions. It has six, six exercises. Van a encontrar seis, seis ejercicios que tienen que resolver. But we are going to see this later. So if you don't have any other questions, so let's start with tonight's topic. I'm going to share with you my screen and we're going to see the presentation of tonight. The last class we were studying simple past using the verb be, right? 
Uh, what are the two forms of the verb be in simple past? Do you remember that information? Was, where. Excellent, thank you. Was and where. And we are going to use those forms in the following exercise. So I'm going to show you this. Okay. Let me know, please, if you can already see my presentation. Yes, teacher. Okay, tonight we're going to learn information question. Information question, simple past tense eh, with the verb be. That is the topic for today, information question. And let's have a review of the last class. So look at this. In this part, use was or where to complete the following sentence. Was, was. and where? The first one. I was at school. I was. I was. Let's see if you're right. Yes, you were right. I was at the school. And the next one, you. You, you were. You were. I'm sorry. You were at the school. And the next one, she. She was in the bed. She was. She was. She was in bed. And the next one. She was tired. Was tired. It was tired. Excellent. And the next one, we. We were, we were playing. We playing. Were playing. Thanks a lot. We were playing. You were right. Next. He he was was a good student. Student. Excellent. He was a good student. Nice. And the last one. They, they were, were good friends. friends. They were good friends. Okay, excellent. So we use was with the pronouns I, she, it, and also with it. And we're going to use where with you, we and they were. So let's see the next one. Next exercise, rewrite, rewrite the sentences in simple past tense. I'm going to show you here a sentence like this one. I am seven years old. This sentence is in present. So can you rewrite or this sentence or retell this sentence in simple past tense? Can you please retell this sentence in past tense for a change? I, I, was, I was seven years old. Thank you, Manuel. You're right. I was seven years old. Let's see the next one. You are my best friend. You was my best friend. You were my best friend. You were my best friend. Thank you. Um, you were. That's the correct the next one, the cat is on a tree. It was. It was, was on a tree. Excellent. The cat is an animal, so the personal pronoun is it. And with it, we use was in the past. So excellent. The cat was on a tree. Perfect. The women are angry. The women was are, are angry. Angry. Oh, well, the, Okay, let's see. The women was angry or the women were angry? The women was angry. Was. Women was are angry. I'm so sorry to tell you this, but you are one. Women, the right the answer is where. The women, that is plural, and says las yes. mujeres. Mm. Las mujeres estaban enojadas. The women were angry. Your bike is in the garage. Your bike was in the garage. Thank you, excellent. That is the right answer. Let's see the next one. Andrew is so shy. Andrew was so shy. He is so shy. Yes, Andrew was so shy. Andrew era muy tímido. The boys are very kind. 
The boys boy were boy. very kind. The boys were very kind. Thanks a lot. And the last one, there is a bottle on the table. There is a bottle on the table. <laughs> the bottle was... was... Where is a bottle? Hey. There. There is a there. bottle was the table. Uh, no, continue trying. There was a bottle on the table. Thank you, Lisa. That is the right answer. There was. was. There was a bottle okay. on the table. Excellent. Oh. So let's see. Here I have the answer. Who wants to practice reading the right answers, please? Teacher. Thank you, Roberto. Me, teacher. Me, teacher. Uh, thank you, Heidi. But before uh, reading the sentences, tell me, Roberto, what is your question? Um, I have a question. Uh, where is, is only, I can use uh, solo cuando mm -hmm. es plural. El where. Mm, yes, we need it's plural, we're going it's, to use where. Y también cuando uso el you, we, and they. Yes. Okay, okay. Okay, excellent, thank you. Now you can read the sentences, please. What? I was seven years old. You were my best friend. The cat was on a tree. The women were angry. Your bike was in the garage. Andrew was so shy. The boys were very calm. There was a bottle on the table. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much. So let's see the next exercise. Can you please complete the sentence in using was and or were? This is the negative form of the verb in past. Was plus not equal to wasn't. Were plus not equal to weren't. So let's see this. I was happy. I was, I was sad. wasn't sad. I wasn't, yeah. Excellent. I was happy. I wasn't sad. Yo estaba feliz. Yo no estaba triste. Let's see the next one. They were at they were school. At school. They were at school. Ah, okay. They were at the school. They were in at the mall. Excellent. The dog was fast. It wasn't it was slow. slow. It wasn't slow. Excellent. You were you were in you were in, you were uh, in Canada. You were. you were in Canada. Okay, excellent. You were in Canada. You weren't in Italy. My dad at the bedroom. He wasn't at the kitchen. My dad, my dad was at the bedroom. Okay, so let's see. I was happy. I wasn't sad. They were at school. They weren't at the mall. The dog was fast. It wasn't slow. You were in Canada. You weren't in Italy. My dad was at the bedroom. He wasn't at the kitchen. So I volunteer to practice reading this, please. Me, teacher. Thanks a lot, Manuel. You can start, please. Okay. I was happy. I wasn't sad. They were at the school. They weren't at the mall. The dog was fast. It wasn't slow. You were in Canada. You weren't in Italy. My dad was at the bedroom. He wasn't at the kitchen. Thanks a lot. Any question in this part? No question, then let's continue. No question. Okay, thanks a lot. So let's see, complete the following question. Choose the correct answer then. So tell me, is what or where? to complete this question. Where? Where you at home yesterday? Yeah, it's the first one, yes. Where you at home yesterday? The next one, your car on the street. 
Where? Where you car? Where? Where was your car on the street? In this case, we're what? going to use was because we're talking about your car. Car is it. In car is it, yes. Was, was your car on the street? The next one, number three. Mm. Where? What? Excellent. Were the children ill? Estuvieron enfermos los niños. The next one, the chicken, delicious. Was. What? What? Okay, was the chicken delicious? Si lo cocinó Manuel, probablemente estaba delicioso. <laughs> yes. It was delicious. <laughs> y nadie se enfermó, sí. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Then the dinner ready. Was. Was. Was the dinner ready. Excellent. Estaba lista la cena. There where? Are a lot of where? where? Okay, excellent. Where? where there are a lot of people. And the next one, was. Claudia Lars, a writer. What? Was. was Claudia Lars, a writer. Then let's see. The next one where is you, Where are you at the library? Library. No. Okay, now let's see. I have here the answer, but let me tell you what is the correct one. Can you match them, please? The question and the answer. And tell me one C, one D, or one E. Choose the correct answer. Were you at home yesterday? What is the correct answer to that question? One C. Letter C. Excellent, you are right. Yes, I was. I was there alone. Sí, estuve en casa, estuve solo. Thank you. To D. Letter D. Letter D in the second. Was your car on the strip? No, it wasn't. It was in the garage. Excellent. Number three, were the children ill? They. E. Letter E. E. Letter E. No, there weren't. No, that's not the correct answer. Letter E. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. Which is the letter? Yes, they were. Yes, but which is G. G. Okay. D. Uh, you say G, this one, G, yes, they were? Yes. Okay, that's the answer. Let's see the next one. Uh, Letter A. What's the chicken delicious? A. Letter A. 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 Yes, it was, it was, it was, so, it was delicious. so delicious. Thanks a lot. Number five, was the dinner ready? Mm, B. B. No, it wasn't. I had to make had it. to make it. Okay. Okay, excellent. No, it wasn't. I had to make it. Uh, where are there a lot of people? Where are there a lot of people? Mm. Where are no. Yes, literally. Where no, there the weren't. Point? And number seven was Claudia Lars, a writer. Her age. Her age. Yes, she was. Yes, she was. Excellent. And the last she one, was. were you at the library? F. 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 No, I wasn't. I was at the mall. So here are the answer. 1C, 2D, 3G, 4A, 5B, 6E, 7H, and finally 8F. So I need two volunteers in this part to practice this part. Who wants to participate? Say me. me. Teacher. Thank you, Manuel. Say me and your name, please. Manuel and me, teacher. Thank you, Heidi. So at this time, Heidi, can you please read the question? And Manuel, can you please read the answer? 
for you to practice. Okay. Were you at home yesterday? Yes, I was. I was there alone. Was your car on the street? No, it wasn't. It was in the garage. <clears throat> were the children killed? Yes, they were. Was the chicken delicious? Yes, it was. It was so delicious. Was the dinner ready? No, it wasn't. It, I had to make it. Were there a lot of people? No, there weren't. Was Claudia Lars a right? Uh, yes, she was. Were you at the library? Uh, vamos a ver. Okay. No, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Excellent. Thank you. Very good job. Just these two words, writer and library. Writer, library. Any question in this part? Do you have any question? No. No question. What is the meaning of feel? What is the meaning of? Can you please repeat your question? What's your question? The question three, the, uh, were the children ill? Oh, estuvieron los niños enfermos. Estuvieron uh, enfermos los niños. Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. The word ill is the same as uh, sick? Yes, it's the same. It, they are synonyms. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you for your questions. Let's continue then. So look at this, I have a conversation and we're going to complete this. So it's between a detective and Malone. So the first question it says, where you last night Malone, it was or where in this case? Where? Where? Let's see, you are right. Yes, you are right, it's where. Where were you last night Malone? Last night. Donde estuviste was. la noche anterior? I was at movie. I was at the movie. I was. Okay, excellent. I was at the movies. Then the uh, was or where? Where you alone? Where? Where you alone? Where you alone? No, I was. I was. I was. I was. I was. I was. No, I was. My wife. Where? No, was. 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 My excellent. Was. My wife was with me. What is all this about? ¿Por qué es todo esto? ¿Qué está sucediendo? Then, there, there, there was, was or there were? were? There was. There was, yes, you're right. There was a robbery last night at the First States Bank. Where, where, where you at the bank in the afternoon, Malone? Yes. Was. yes. I was. I was. I was. Yes, I was. There, there, was. Was. there was a lot. There were. There were. There were. There were. There were. There were. Okay, now this is the, there were. I'm sorry. I'm going to fix it in a moment. Just let me finish. It's where. There were a lot of people. So what? Well, Malone, last night your car was was your car the was bank. at the parking lot near the bank. Near the bank. I know. We were, we were at the movies, we were watching, movies a great movie. watching a great movie. Cinema, cinema is near the bank. Okay, Malone, you may go home this time, but I'll be watching you. Okay. So, por qué, or what is the conversation about? What is this conversation about? Tell me. What do you think is the conversation about? Robert, Robert. Oh, it's about a robbery, right? Robert. What, is Robert. Robert. what is the name right. of the bank? What is the name of the bank? 
First State Bank. First State. Uh -huh. First State Bank. First State Bank. And where was Malone last night? ¿Dónde estuvo él? Malone. In the movie. In the movie. Okay, he was at the cinema, right? He was at the cinema. Okay, excellent job. Okay, you guess all of them. You guess all of the correct answers. So thank you very much. Two volunteers to practice this small conversation. Me. Thank you, Roberto and Patricia. Roberto, you are the detective, and Patricia, okay. you are Malone. Okay. Okay. I can start. Yes, please. You can start. Uh -huh. Where were you last night, Malone? I was at the movies. Were you alone? No, I was I wasn't. My wife uh, was with me. What is all this about? There was a robbery last night at the Fear State. Ah, bank. Were you at the bank in the afternoon, Malone? Yes, I was. There were a lot of people. So what? Well, Malone, last night your car was at the parking lot near the bank. I know. We were at the movies watching a great movie. The cinema is near the bank. Okay, Malone. You may go home this time, but I will be watching you. Okay, thanks a lot. You did an excellent job. That was almost perfect. Thanks a lot. So, any other volunteer to practice this small conversation? Hi, Francisco. Me, for um, sure. Francisco and? Can you please? Lizette. Okay, Lizette and Francisco. So, Lizette, you are going to be the detective, and Francisco, you are going to be alone, please. Okay, okay. let's start. Where were you? You last night, Malone? I was at the movies. Were you alone? No, I wasn't. My wife was with me. What is all this about? There was a robbery last night at the first state I bank. Were you at the bank in the afternoon, Malone? Yes, I was. There were a lot of people. So what? Well, Malone, last night your car was at the parking lot near the bank. I know. We were at the movies watching a great movie. The cinema is near the bank. Okay, Malone. You may go home this time, but... He'll be watching you. <laughs> Excellent. Thanks a lot. Just this I'll. I'll be watching you. This is I'll. I'll. Yes, I'll be watching you. Okay. Excellent. Do you have any question? New vocabulary at this part? Any word or phrase that you don't know? Let me know, please, if you have a question. Robbery, teacher. Is uh, como robo, asalto, hurto? Yes, that is a robbery. robbery. Un asalto. Okay. Any other question? Teacher, the meaning of near? Near, cerca. Is cerca. Uh -huh. Yes, thank, thank you. you. Cerca. The parking lot is near the bank. El parqueo está cerca yeah. del banco. Yes. I'll be watching you. Ah, oh, this is this is a contraction. I will. I will be watching you. It's una estructura it's para. Future. Ah, así es. Futuro. Es para hablar acerca del futuro. Estaré observando. I will be watching you. Okay. Thank you. Any other question? No more question, then let's see. Let's continue then. 
Tonight we're going to hear this, right? WH word question or information question. Uh, let's see the example in this. For example, where were you last night, Malone? This is an information question. You can say yes or no. You have to get information. In this type of question, you have to get information. Tiene que dar información. El siguiente ejemplo, were you alone? Esta es una yes, no question. Usted puede decir, no, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Respondemos con yes or not. In this case, cuando tiene una WH word, you have to get information. Like this example. Uh, let's see, where were you born? It is asking you for a place, right? Donde? Y la primera, were you born in the US? This is a yes, no question. Were you born in the US? Then you say, yes, I was. No, I wasn't. En este otro tipo de preguntas, information question, usted tiene que dar esa información. ¿Dónde naciste? I was born in Korea. Yo nací en Korea. So this is the structure we are going to use to make this type of question. WH word, was or word, subject, and complement. So look at this example, WH word, where? What's the meaning of this word? Donde. donde. Yes, donde. Then we're going to use was or where. In this case, como el sujeto es you, vamos a necesitar where. Where were you? Subject, complement, born. When were you born? And the question mark. Y el signo de pregunta. Then let's see the other example. Was your brother born in 1984? Yes, he was or no, he wasn't. This is the yes, no question. Look at the information question. When was he born? He was born in 1985. Then when, what's the meaning of this question? When? Cuando. When? Yes, you're right. Thanks a lot. When? Cuando. Cuando nació él. Él nació en 1985. Now look at this. Were your parents born in Inchon? This is a yes no question. So you can, yes, they were. No, they weren't. What city were they born in? ¿En qué ciudad nacieron ellos? What city were they born in? They were born in Seoul. Ellos nacieron en Seoul. So, ¿Cómo que ya la gran tutorial al final de los lados rápidamente? Hola, amigos. Do you have any question? If you don't have any question, let's see some examples. We are going to practice this tonight. Look at this. Where were you born? This expression means, donde naciste? Where were you born? And you say, I was born in China. Y let's see, uh, where did you grow up? I grew up in Beijing. How was your first days at the school? How was your first day at the school? Yeah, I was a little nervous. Estaba un poco nervioso. Nervioso. Why? Why were you nervous? Porque estabas nervioso. Because there were many children. Who was your first friend at the school? His name was William. What was he like? He was so funny and friendly. Now, information, right? Information question. The first one, where were you born? It's asking for a place. The next one, where did you grow up? It's asking for a place too. How was your first day of the school? Como fue? How was your first day of the school? And you say, I was a little nervous. Estaba un poco nervioso. Then why is asking for a reason? Por una razón, why were you nervous? Because there were many children. Who was your first friend of the school? He's asking for a person who. Quien, who was your first friend at the school? His name was William. What was he like? Look at this expression. Como era él? He was so funny and friendly. 
Do you have any question about this? These are uh, who has word question, verdad? Yes, WH word question or information questions. Okay, gracias. Okay, do you remember this? How was your first day at the school? Do you remember that? ¿Se acuerdan todavía de su primer día en la escuela? Really not. <laughs> Okay, no, not really. I don't remember that. Yeah. Okay, now let's see. Two volunteers to practice this. Me, Hi, teacher. Frank. Yeah, Francisco and me. Eric. Eric. Okay, Francisco and Eric. Thanks a lot. So, Eric, you are going to be A, and Francisco, you are going to be B. Help me, please. Where were you born? I was born in China. Where did you grow up? Grow up? I grew up in, in Beijing. How was your first day at the school? I was a little nervous. <laughs> Why were you nervous? Because there were many children. Who was your first friend at the school? His name was William. What was he like? He was so funny and friendly. Thanks a lot. You did a great job. Almost perfect. Just this. First. First. That is the correct pronunciation of this word. First. Any other volunteer to practice in these small conversations, please? Me, teacher. Me. Manuel. Manuel Me. and. Me, teacher. Thank you, Vanessa. Manuel and Vanessa, please. <coughs> Manuel, you are going to be A, and Vanessa, you are going to be B. Okay. Where were you born? I was born in China. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Beijing. How was your first day at school? I was a little nervous. Why were you nervous? Because there were many children. Who was your first friend in, at school? His name was William. What was he like? He was a fun a finger. Thank you very much. You did a great job in this part. Thanks a lot. Very good job. So these were, please. He was so funny and friendly. Funny and friendly. Funny and friendly. Excellent. He was so funny and friendly. Él era muy divertido y muy amigable. So, who was your first friend at the school? Do you remember that? Nobody remember his or her first friend at the school? Mm, no. <laughs> ya, ya no. Yeah, happy. <laughs> Fue hace tanto, dice que ya no me acuerdo. Okay. His name was William. Okay, his name was William yes. too? Yes, he's uh, ah, okay. uh, primo. Ah, he's your cousin. He's your primo. Then you are still friends. Are you still friends? Todavía son amigos? Yes. Okay, excellent. Okay, then look at this. We are going to choose a color. If you want to participate, just tell me which color do you want. And under the color, we are going to find some question. So let me know, please, which one do you want? Who wants Yellow. to start? Blue. Tatiana says blue. This one. Let's see. Okay, look at this question. Were you stressful yesterday? Yes. 
Okay, this is a yes, yes no was. question. You say yes, I was or no, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Yes, yes I, I was. was. Ah, okay, but yesterday was Sunday. Um, mucho oficio en la casa. Ah, there are too much work at home too. Okay, so you were yes. stressed. Thank you. Any other volunteer? Purple. No, you say purple. I hate purple, and then we're going to go with yellow. So let's see in purple. Who was your favorite teacher at the school? My, uh, I was favorite teacher uh, sociales. My favorite teacher was the social My favorite studies. Teacher was social studies. Teacher, okay. Excellent, then you say yellow. Let's go with yellow. Were you a good student in the past? Yes, I was. <laughs> yes, I was, okay, excellent. Were you a good student? And she said, yes, I was. Any other color? Black. Pink. Oh, then let's go with black and then with pink. So where were you born? Where were you born in El Salvador? And you say, I was born in, I, in the place. I was born in El Salvador. Excellent. I was born in El Salvador. Now, if I ask you, where were you born in El Salvador? Donde en El Salvador? Where in El Salvador? Uh, say, uh, I was born in Rosario de Mora. Ah, okay, excellent. Then you say pink, right? Thank you, Eric. Very good answer. Let's go with pink. Were you at home yesterday? Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Okay. Excellent. That is a yes, no question. Were you at home yesterday? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Any other color? Red. Red. Let's see what is under the color red. Oh. And it says, when were you born? It is asking for time. When? When were you born? It's the day, bro. It's the day, true. Es el dato, ¿verdad? Yes, it's the year. When were you born? I was born in... I was born in uh, August 25. Oh, okay. In this case, you have to say on, on August, on August 25th. Uh, 25th. Okay, excellent. But it's most common to answer this question with the year. Con el año en el que usted nació. When were you born? I was born in, and you say the year. Um, sería entonces, eh, I was born... On August 25th, eh, 1988. 1988, excellent, excellent. You can say the whole date, toda la fecha, o solo el año. I was born in 1988, excellent. So let's go with the next color. Which color do you want? We still had gray, light blue. Light blue. Green. Okay, light blue and then green. Let's see. Oh, look at this question. Who was your first boyfriend or girlfriend? Do you remember that? I know was. <laughs> let's, let's go with the next question. It is going to be better. Vamos a la siguiente. So it says, who was your first boyfriend or girlfriend? Let's see green. What was your favorite subject? At the school or high school, what was your favorite subject? And you say, my favorite subject was... My favorite subject was mathematics. Mathematics, excellent. I still have here gray, 
orange and ochre. So which one do you want? Okay. Okay, look at this. What was your favorite movie when you were a kid? And you say, my favorite movie was, and the name of the movie. My favorite movie is Scooby-Doo. Okay, excellent. My favorite movie was Scooby-Doo. Perfect. Gray or orange, which one do you want? Let me know. Orange. Orange, let's see what is under orange. What was your favorite cartoon? My favorite cartoon is Snoopy. Uh, favorite was cartoon is Snoopy. Excellent. So you say my favorite cartoon was Snoopy. My favorite cartoon was Snoopy. And the last one. Who was your favorite singer when you were a teenager? Who wants to answer this question? ¿Quién era su cantante favorito cuando era adolescente? My favorite singer was eh, RBD. Ah, ok, excelente. RBD. Nice. My singer favorite was, eh, was Three Boys. Bass Three Boys, excelente. We still has one. This is white, the white color. Let's see. What was your favorite game when you were a kid? My favorite game was Trompo. Okay, Trompo. Which other my one? Favorite, uh, my favorite game was play soccer. To play soccer. My favorite game was play soccer. Play soccer too. Okay, excellent. Let's continue then. Thanks a lot. You did a great job with this question. Were you a good student? Yes, no question. Who was your favorite teacher? Information question. What was your favorite subject? It's another information question. What was your favorite game? It's another information question. Who? Information question. What was your favorite cartoon? Same, right? Information question. Were you stressful yesterday? Yes, no question. Were you at home yesterday? Yes, no question. And let's continue practicing. Let me see. Give me a second here. Okay, this question is for Jonathan Josué. Uh, what was your favorite cartoon, Jonathan? My favorite cartoon? Yes. Uh, I don't know. My favorite cartoon was The Rugrats. Los Rugrats. Okay, The Rugrats. Excellent. Y Monica Calderón. When were you born? When were you born? Hello, Monica. Okay, probably she is busy. I was born in 1973. Okay, thanks a lot. Thank you. Let's go with the next thing. Thanks a lot for your answer. Thank you. So look at this, we're going to have this conversation practice. Yeah, where were you born? What is the answer for that question? Who wants to answer it? I was born in was born. San Salvador. Thank you, Manuel. I was born in San Salvador. Excellent, any other answer, please? When were you born? I was born in San Salvador. 
Thank you, Roberto. Any no, other no. answer? Any other answer for the first one? Where were you born? It's la primera. The first question. No. And you say, I was born in a place. I was born. And you say, a place, the place. Any other answer? Practice, practice. This is the moment for you to practice. You can do it. I was for a popa. Excellent, Tatiana. I was born in a popa. Thank you. Any other answer? I was born in first May. March. Oh, okay. Um, I I was born in nineteen ninety. Uh, okay, thank you. But that is the answer for the second question. When were you born? Cuando nació? And you say I was born in, and you say the year. You say the year. Who wants to answer this? When were you born? I was born in 1988. Excellent. That is the right answer. Any other answer? When were you born? I was born in 1982. 1982. Okay, excellent. Excellent answer. One more. The last answer for the second question. I was born in 19... 93. Okay, excellent. Excellent. Thank you. Excellent answer. So, how was your first day at the school? Who wants to answer this question? In this case, how was your first day at the school? ¿Cómo fue su primer día en la escuela? And let's change at the school and let's change for at work. How was your first day at work? I know, remember. You don't remember your first day at work? El primer día que llegó a trabajar? Ese sí. <laughs> Full nervous. <laughs> ah, okay. Then you say, I was nervous. I was nervous. I was excited. Estaba emocionado. I was angry. Estaba enojado porque al fin encontré. <laughs> I was <cool>. very happy. <laughs> ah, excellent. Happy. I, I was very happy. Excellent. I was um, very happy, but now, no. <laughs> but now I am sad. But now I, I, I am was sad. dreams and illusions. <laughs> ah, okay. Dreams and illusions. Okay. okay. Devastating. <laughs> and now you feel devastated. I'm so sorry to hear that. Now let's My see. mom very happy. <laughs> ah, your mother was very happy. Yo creo que ella fue la más feliz el primer día después. Ah, okay. Finalmente encontró trabajo, she said. Finally, she found a job. And then let's see. Who was your best friend? Who was your very first friend at work, let's say, en su trabajo? Who was your first friend at work? You don't have friend at work, just co-worker? Yes. Oh, I have a name, Dinora. Ah, okay. Her um, name. Her name was Dinora. What was she like? Como era ella? Friendly. Can you say she was? She was friendly. Um, she was happy. Oh, she was happy. Okay, now let's go crazy. with the next. Oh, she was crazy too. <laughs> she was crazy. How was your weekend? How was your weekend? Como, como estuvo su fin de semana? You say, it was good. It was perfect. Okay. It was it bad. Was good. Thank you, Lisette. It was well good. Any other answer? Very good. It was very good. Excellent. Any other answer? How was your weekend? Tell me, how was your weekend? What do you say 
It was trabajoso, good. lleno de trabajo. It was busy. It was busy. It was very busy, you can say, too. Okay. It was very busy and the inf uh, uh, work in the mineral consulting project. Project. In okay. the mineral project. Okay. Let's see the last question. How much was the last thing you bought? ¿Cuánto gastó en la última cosa que compró? No me diga qué cosa, just the price. How much was the last thing you bought? ¿Cuánto costó? And you say it was... Four dollars. It was four dollars. It was 30 dollars. Okay, 30 dollars. Excellent. 30 dollars. was... $230. Two hundred thirty dollars. Okay. How do you say perdí la cuenta? <laughs> okay, you say uh, you say I lost the price or I lost the bill. Perdí la I cuenta. lost the bill. Okay, now here are how to answer this question. You say the first one, I, where were you born? I was born in, and you say the place. And the second one, when were you born? You say the year. Uh, it was, how was your first day at the school? You say it was pleasant adjective. Uh, who was your first friend at the school? He or she was, plus the name. He or she was an adjective in the second one. ¿Cómo era ella? Ella fue, era amable, kind, angry, enojada, you say crazy. How was your weekend? My weekend was, and you use an adjective. My weekend was exciting. My weekend was perfect. In the last one, how much was the last thing you bought? It was. Let me fix it. It here. It was, and then here is a mistake. Here is the place and the answer where. You are going to answer with a place and when you are going to answer with the year. El año que usted nació. Do you have any question about today's class? No question. No teacher. No question? Okay, then just to say thank you for your punctuality, for your attention, and also for your participation. Thank you very much. Please don't forget to keep working on the platform exercises and evaluation. You still have three days to complete that. So I'm sure that you can do it. If you don't have any other question, good night and see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. See you. Good tomorrow. night. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Thank you, teacher. Good night. See you. Bye. -bye. See you. Bye, teacher. Bye. 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 -bye.